So now we have the hole with us, and that should allow us to uh, put it on the wall down here. Alright. Let's toss it on the wall. Let's see what we got going. Nice. Okay, Nate, maybe you can tell us something better about upstairs that critter didn't have in mind. Magic has always creeped me out, but I have to save the lives of a few fuzzballs I barely know. Actually, what am I doing here? <laughs> You're being the good guy, Nate. Don't wow. worry about it. Yeah, it is pretty wow. It is crazy in here. All right, let's go check out these paintings, shall we? Hmm, the clouds form an almost white background. If it weren't for that stupid angel, I could use that as a background for my painting. Hmm. The angel is clinging to the wall. I can't get the picture off. Is the angel really that strong? Let's check out the optical illusion. This picture shows something impossible. Yeah, what is it? This picture. Uh, is that is that all you're going to tell me? All I can see is it's like a box or something. I have no idea. The picture shows a pig leading its piggy life. Huh. Scare the pig, huh? Hey, hello, pig. Nothing. Totally unperturbed. It just keeps on stuffing its face. You can't, like, flick it or something? Hey, hello, pig. Nothing. Totally unperturbed. It just keeps on stuffing its face. That clown over there looks a little bit terrifying. <laughs> I don't know why that caught my eye, but yeah. Um, I wonder if we could scare the pig. Yes, we can. Oh, that's what it is. That is an optical illusion. Where did it go? That angel is having so much fun strumming that thing. Fascinating. <laughs> All right, so um, obviously we need to do something with that pig. Not quite sure what. Let's check out these paintings. The painting shows a cake. There's a word written on the icing. Hmm. It might read lie. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. Okay, the portal references just keep coming. Let's check out the sad clown. Wow, now that's what I call art. The painting shows a clown, but he's sad. Yes. That's that's something. I I've, I've seen sad clowns before. Plenty. Wow. Now that's Okay. Um let's see what Nate has to say about the door. The door is protected by a mechanism that doesn't look like it can be forced. No? I can't really tell what the mechanism is. It's like, uh... Two, uh... Two door knockers? I can't tell what that is. The Archmage's office must be somewhere back there. That would be the place to look for magical artifacts. Hmm. The door is pre- Alright. How about the balcony? The balcony is too far away to jump up there, uh, down, over. But isn't there a ladder in front of the tower outside? Is there? That might be helpful. I bet the Archmage's office is up there. But how do I get there? Possibly the ladder you just mentioned? Isn't there a ladder in front of the tower outside? Okay. Maybe it's time to have a look around out there. It seems like we really need to go outside at this point. Let's see if Nate has anything to say about this. It's one of those moments where I wish someone could give me a hint. Okay, so that's that's not going to help at all. Um, you win for now. <laughs> we'll I'll come be back. back. To that. Yes, we will be back, Nate. But um, not not now. Figure it out later. Let's check out this basin. There's at least a dozen glowing jellyfish in the basin. Useful little beasts, but it's a bad idea to put baking powder in their water. Not that I've ever done that. What is it, kind of like baking soda and vinegar or something? 
I don't think the jellyfish can help us. This tower has plenty of light as it is. And insanity. <laughs> light and insanity. Sounds about right. Got a pentagram up here. Usually you can see from the alignment of a pentagram whether it's used for white or black magic. But in this tower, I don't think I can tell. Yeah, it does kind of flip upside down. Check out if there's anything over here for us. Uh... What the? Okay, that didn't work. Let's try that again. Nope. I'm doing something wrong. <laughs> I wonder how many things Nate will say about this. The tower doesn't like me. I'm beginning to think that's true. The tower doesn't like me. Okay, I think he's out of things to say now. Okay, I guess the only way down is through the portal. We've made good progress here in the tower. More or less. Maybe it's time to have a look outside as well. Okay, well, um... Let's hope Mazaz isn't out there. Hey, the ladder. Oh, she's still there. That woman is persistent. Why, oh why, must I be so irresistible? Yeah, that's why she's after you. She'll spot us if we just walk out there. All right, Critter, here's the plan. I'll distract Mizaz, you cross behind her, head to the ship, and then... We'll see. <laughs> that is a plan! The best we have! Here goes nothing. Oh boy. I don't know if this is gonna work. Hey, Zazzy! Oh! I suppose that fountain is kind of in the middle. Maybe we can use that. <laughs> Kurt just passed by. Say hi! See ya! <laughs> Let's check out the well. Yes, it has water. Uh, that seems to be about all we know about it. <laughs> Already tired? Put on a bit of weight over the past few months, did you? That's a great thing to say. If she ever catches you, she's going to rip your eyes out and then probably beat them to you or something. Well, let's check out this ladder. Cool. Yes, it's a ladder. I, I think that's what, what is it, Zazzy? Meant. Weren't you going to catch me? <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's take the ladder. How that fits in his stomach, I will never know. Grapes. Anything else over here? Go down to the city. <laughs> Already tired? Put on a bit of weight over the past few months, did you? Ah! Um, no. He. I think he just said that they would hang him? I'm confused. People would see you, hang you. Okay. What is it, Zazzy? Weren't you going to catch me? Got a rope here. <laughs> so does that mean rope? Because he said the same thing about the basket when he was looking at it. Hmm. Interesting. Box. Yes, it is a box. Let's open it up. <laughs> Already tired? No. Put on a bit of weight over the past few months, did you? <laughs> Not able to open it. Um, can go down to the cabin. See if there's something here. All right. Um, got the skeletal arm down here. I can do something with it. Yes, it is dead. Yeah, 
and that's all you're gonna say about that. Let's check out what we got in the wardrobe. <laughs> oh, that's terrible. Oh boy. Okay. <laughs> I did not see that coming. All right. What else we got? We got a metal bar here. Uh huh. Let's take it. Much like everything else, it's a little bit too high. Landing net? It catches things. The hell is that for? I have no idea what you would use this for. For landing. I mean, I guess you could use it to to like grab onto something and hold the ship in place. I, I don't know exactly how you would use that at all. Got a quill here. Yes, there is a broken bird somewhere. Wine bottle. Mmm, drink. So, with that said, I think we have food and drink for uh, the painting. Of course, we have to paint it somehow. Check out the mirror. Uh, I'm guessing he's saying that uh, he's a critter. Yes, that's what that means. We can talk to you. By the eight winds, what are you? Yep, that means critter. That Nate hasn't the faintest idea how to navigate. But at least he's human and not, not, an otter. <laughs> it takes one to know one. <laughs> I think he basically said, no, I'm not. Oh, joy, the pink otter wishes to talk to me. <laughs> I saw that. <laughs> All right, so the Mary and Critter don't seem to like each other very much. Hmm, I wonder if we can catch this thing with the net. Mm, not quite. And we can, uh, where did the net, there it is. Let's try it again. <laughs> Alright, that doesn't seem to be working. Hmm. If we had a glove on the end of the net? No. Can I... I can throw the glove at the skeleton hand. Uh... I think he's saying that the skeleton hand is in a hole and it wouldn't be able to get it? Maybe if I push the skeleton hand to another place it will be uh, more helpful. Let's try that again. That thing seems to like that. <laughs> How it makes noises, I will not know. Sweet! We have ourselves a skeleton arm. Alright, uh, anything else in here? Can talk to her again. Um, still the metal bar there. Nope, nothing. Not that I can see anyway. What is it, Zazzy? Weren't you going to catch me? All right, well, um, let's try to go back. We've got a bunch of stuff. Maybe we can do something with it. Zazzy's not very good at running. Yeah, I'd run slower, but that would be embarrassing for both of us. You could fight instead of running! I don't want to destroy all your hopes of besting me at something. <laughs> Kiss my boot! Sooner or later! You'll have to go down to the city or back to your ship. And that's where I'll be waiting. But, um, come back. You, you, green skin. Come on, I'll give you a head start. Half a lap. Zazzy. So, 
so considering that Nate is so much faster than Zazzy, it doesn't really seem like in the second game, or the first game, depending on how you look at it, that he really needed to um, stop Zazzy in any specific way, because she was already going to lose for that, uh, that mountain run. Whatever, you know, I, I don't know. Maybe maybe he would uh he would run out of uh, breath after a while and she's kind of like the turtle that keeps on going just a little bit slower than him. I have no idea. And we're down here again. Can I not get out of here? Hey! Stop right there. No, no I can't. Well, at least he looks like a costume, I guess. Hmm. Yeah, that's right. Make during noises at her. That's gonna that's gonna keep you hidden. Hmm. What do I got? You're trying to distract me, aren't you? I won't fall for that. Okay, so she just she just leaves if you sit around long enough. Hmm. The skeleton arm might be helpful. I don't know. Wait a minute, what was it? the rug? Oh yeah. That was so cool. Maybe I can sneak out through the uh, little port thing from earlier. I was not even thinking about that. Yes, yes, it makes squeaky noises. Let's let's open it up. No, not happening. Need a key. Ah, oh, come on. If you if you look at it, I can I can use the the thing from earlier. It's just a combination lock. No, I guess they don't expect you to remember from earlier. Hmm. Well, I'm gonna try the skeleton arm on her and see what happens. Cause I think she'll come again. Hey! Stop right there! Maybe this will distract her long enough that I can get out of here. Try this thing. Yes. What the? Get off me! <laughs> oh, I want to get out of here. Hmm. She dropped her axe. Well, that wasn't something that distracted her for me to get out. Yes, it is for orcs, but we'll take it anyway. Hmm. So we can't distract her with the hands to get out of here. Maybe we can chop this hatch and get out? Pick lock? I don't think so. <laughs> that is definitely not how you pick a lock, but, uh... Okay, <laughs> I guess so. We'll, we'll go with that. Walk down, slam into the ground. <laughs> yes, it's very funny. We just set a trap. Okay. I see. <laughs> Alright, well that means that I probably need to get the hand again. Because she's not going to step on that on her own, I would imagine. Have a glove. Nice glove, right here. Enjoy. <laughs> All right, let's see if this works. Hey, stop right there. Alright, with any luck, we should be able to uh, get her to fall into a hole. 
At least that's the hope. Oh, I've really had it now. Oh. Ah! <laughs> Nice. Let me out. <laughs> All right. <laughs> yes, she's very mean and angry. And now I can't use this thing to get the uh, hand out of there, so this glove. Well, I can't even use it at all. It's not even showing it. All right. Well, should be able to get out of here now. <laughs> 